Bowie always, even in his teenage years, have that quintessential Randy voice? No, he didn't always have that voice. He kind of, I think it came from marijuana and yelling. When I met him, his voice was the same. <laughs> he didn't have like a speaking voice. That's how he really talked. And it was really surprising. First time that Leslie Nielsen met Randy Savage, they're talking, Leslie pulls me off to the side and he says, you know, him affecting that voice like that is gonna cost him in the long run. And I said, he's not affecting anything. That's just, that's just Randy. What are you doing, uh huh? Yeah, naked gun. I like it. Dig it. Uh huh. It was just Randy. Randy always talked the same. You could pick somebody up off the street and do a Randy Savage impersonation. It's not hard. We'll definitely have our super cut of everyone doing their. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, she's not here, brother. Uh huh. So tonight I hear we're going to do something a little different. Hmm? Oh, brother. It's gonna be crazy, brother. His intensity, ooh, yeah. Somebody might be thinking they want to take the macho man spot, you know? Beef, spice, snap into a Slim Jim. Make sure now, brother, because if you don't, don't worry, Randy, we will. If you ask him something, it's like, well, I don't know. Thinking about something. It's like, I'm just the macho man, uh-huh. Your first name, macho, last name, man, yeah, uh-huh. That's the way he talked, uh-huh, yeah. But sometimes when you're just talking, you're getting this guy, and then when it's promo time, freak out, freak out, uh-huh. Yeah, I'm thinking, thinking, thinking. Yeah, you get a little more intensity. Turn the volume up. But when it's time to talk to Randy, I'll come down here, and I'm still right here because that's my voice. He's fun to imitate. The Iron Sheik is fun to imitate, but Randy's fun to imitate, too but nobody can do it just like that.